The river is wild, it is free. It brings a lot of gravel from, but transports it down to the sea. It is covered only by the fishing today, something like 16 or 17 species, and probably tomorrow we find more. We find a very, very large amount of very rare aquatic insects. This is a situation which we think uh, we had in Central of Europe maybe 150 years ago. If you build a dam, uh, you destroy this. I love rivers and that is an amazing system. We spend here about a week and every day you get closer to the river, you understand the river, you see more because what you see is in the detail, it's not the large scale thing, it's, it's a fascinating landscape when you look at it, it's great, it's wilderness, it's wilderness areas. Whenever you go a meter, there's a different ecosystem in front of you. You, know, you, you step another step, it's a different one, so it's a mosaic. It's a huge mosaic of several puzzle stones and that creates a big picture in the end. The whole river should become a wild river national park. That would be the first one in Europe and that would create income for the local people because tourists from all over Europe would come, even from the US to see a wild river. This is the only chance in Europe where you can establish such a national park. First you have to understand the river and at the moment it's not understood. If we gain a better understanding, people will, be, will say no, no time. Yeah.